There are three ways to search for files. One is a text search. Anything that can be reduced to a text phrase can be searched for here. I happen to know that this file right here talks about menus. If I create a new tag, and that tag is called menus, I can now drag this tag onto this file. So, now, when I search for menus, 203-0001 AVI comes up in the search results list. That's how you work with tags. Vegas gives you a head start here with some audio tags and some video tags. Those are useful and you can drag those to your files. As I said, this is going to be an investment in time to get this all set up, but once you get it set up, you'll be able to find any given file in a snap. So we've looked at text-based queries. By the way, if we put a minus in front of whatever we're looking at in the text field, Media Manager interprets that as not menus and gives us any of the files that do not have menus associated with it. We've looked at tags. We created our own tag and searched for it. We can clear the search results field here. And this is the advanced area where we can build a query using particular search criteria. We can take a look for audio streams that have certain keywords attached, and then we can enter the keywords here, for example. So once again, if we look just for keywords in the advanced section, we get the menus file. If we look for video streams that have the word menus, this file shows up. If we look for audio streams that have the word menus associated, this file also shows up because the audio stream is a part of the AVI file. Note the Properties panel over here when we actually have a file, when we actually click on a file. All the information that's available about that file. Another way to deal with properties is to use the push pin here, and that allows this to slide out of the way until you specifically need it. or you can keep it up all the time. I can hear the questions forming on your lips, one of them being, why would I need to use this? Here's the power. Let's take a look at this clip again. Okay, Vanna White. Now we've created a Vanna tag that we can tag over here. So now this particular clip has two categories under which we can search. One is menus, and one is Vanna. Now that we've attached the Vanna tag to that file, if we search for Vanna, we get the file. If we search for Vanna and menus, we get the file as well. This is an extremely powerful tool, but you're going to have to spend the time to tag the files that you already have. By the way, once your library is created, it's a good idea to back it up, and back it up to a different hard drive than the one that contains the original MediaLib file. The Media Manager, a powerful database-driven tool to help you manage your assets in Vegas.